on Mikey the Pie Wizard is here and I am here for a new LP because now I finally have a Wii again I had a Wii once before now I have one again because my friend Dylan, he's awesome. Dylan Perry, subscribe to him. Um, he gave me his old Wii, and he also gave me a game that he had that I've been wanting to do a playthrough of forever. And now that I have that game, we're going to do that. So it is New Super Mario Bros. Wii. I really can't wait to do this game. This game is so much fun. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so let's see. File 1 is my normal file, so we're going to use file 2. And file 3 is going to be... But right now, I'm only doing a solo playthrough of it, but I also want to try and do a multiplayer playthrough, so that's going to be file 3. I don't know when I'm going to be able to do the multiplayer one, though, because I need friends to do it. I know one friend that wants to do it with me, and he can definitely do it with me, but I still need more. I still need two more friends, because... I want to do a four-player playthrough, not just two players. I want to do ultimate four-player. Because I've never actually played this game in four-player, actually. Surprisingly. But anyways, I've played it in two-player and I've played it in three-player. I've never played it in four players. So that would be interesting. Anyways, let's start a new file. One player. And let's watch the storyline and see what happens. Today is Princess Peach's birthday. So there's the first Koopaling, Larry. He's waiting for us, so let's go ahead and try and get to him as fast as we can. I'm gonna see if I can complete all of World 1 in one part, so let's go quickly with this. Let's -a go, Mario. I really wish I could play as Luigi. Only in multiplayer. Also, I haven't played this game in forever, so <laughs> my skills might be a little bit rusty, but that's okay. Coins all over the place. I know I said hurry up, but I, I still want to show like all the secrets and stuff. Oops.
midway point. Here's the propeller mushroom. And another propeller mushroom. Two star coins down, one to go. The last one is the easiest one out of all. But first, a little secret right here. Boom. Coin mania. And extra lives all around. Alright, third star coin. Oh, I didn't even get an extra life. Who cares? It's not like I need tons of extra lives. Plus, we already got seven extra lives in that stage. You start out with five lives, I have twelve now. <laughs> Anyways. All right, level two, underground. Normally when I have propeller and I go into other stages, it makes me happy that I have propeller in those stages, but there are some stages where it just makes more sense. I don't know why. Okay, I'm just like moving all around. It makes more sense to not have propeller. Like, just for some stages for me. I don't know why. Because Propeller is a really OP power-up, but, you know. Whatever. I like having ice on this stage. Unless I'm in multiplayer, in which case, shoot, I'll totally just go all out with Propeller. Oh, right. I just like collecting coins. Eh. There, I wanted to get that before I get the invincibility star. Alright. Now let's go to the toad house. Yay! Red toad house.
power up panels. Okay. Let's go. Come on, baby. Papa needs some new power ups. Oh, I knew that one was bad, but I punched it anyways. Because I didn't care. I'm seeing a pattern. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, well. I got some good stuff. Yay! Clap, clap, clap. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Level three. Yoshi time. Oh, yeah. Yoshi. Whoops. Dang it, he's in he's frozen in ice now. Well, that didn't mean to go that way. Whatever. And I'm stuck. <laughs> I also didn't mean to jump off my Yoshi. You can eat the hammer bros hammers, by the way. I think it's the yeah. Just ride the block. Propeller. What the heck? I didn't even spin off my Yoshi. Wow, that was stupid. You know, who cares? At least I'll get fire. And then I'll be going back into the level again, so I'll have another chance to get propeller. Fire? Come here, hammer, bro. There we go. Oh, he jumped over the gap. Crafty mushroom. And yes, I just assumed the mushroom's gender. I called it a he. Don't judge me. <laughs> Level 3 completed. And here comes the toad. Mario, bad news! This letter just got dropped off at the castle! I ordered my minions to stuff every annoying toad they catch into a question mark block. Ha! If you want to save them, come alone. You won't get any help from your friends. Bowser Jr. I'm worried about them. If you find a toad, carry him to the goal! Now I'll help them later. Now we gotta go back into here because there's a secret flag that leads to the cannon. It's so much easier to kill those hammer bros with fire. <laughs> Oh, 
Seriously, stop shaking it. I can't get the stupid extra life because you killed one of them, Mario. You suck. Oh, shoot. I thought you could eat those guys. Whatever. Ice. Holy cow. I just wanted to get those. The secret flag is back here. And I also want to get this. There we go. Another propeller. Shoot. I just missed one coin. Woohoo! Right this way. Excuse me. The cannon leads you to World 5, so we'll use it when we unlock World 5, because I want to do 100% playthrough, so we're going to wait until we get to World 5. Anyway, Star Toad House. Star Toad Houses are boring, they just give you a star. And you can only use them at the beginning of the level, so it's like, basically, pointless. Alright, fortress time. And no, it's not castle, it's fortress. If you play with me and you call them a castle, I will get confused, just saying. I will think you actually mean castle, because they're called fortresses, and in the DS they're called towers, not castles. Just saying, I will get confused. If you're not playing with me, then call them whatever the heck you want, but if you're playing with me, call them that. Now! I was so close. Well, I tried to throw an ice ball, but I don't really care. There's more ice flowers up here. Actually, no, it's a roulette block. I can't believe I called it a roulette block. <laughs> I always forget the name of roulette blocks. I always just call them changing blocks. More propeller. There we go. Well, you suck. Oh, I thought that one had... Oh, well. There will be more power-ups right here, because there's a red coin ring. There's a red coin ring. Oh, well, gee, thanks. <laughs> that one just gives you a fire. I already have fire. All right, Larry, time to go down. Larry, the easiest coupling.
It's been 20 minutes. Oh, yeah. We're blazing through this world. Alright, 1 4. In this playthrough, I already have all the parts planned out. So if something happens, like my camera just automatically shuts off on me, I will name them episode 1 1, 1 1, and episode 1 2. But if I don't have enough time to do a certain part, then I will do it 5 1 and 5 2. Because I already have all the parts planned out. Because I'm plenty like that. Swimming. Screw you. Also, this block gives you mushrooms. Oh, he died. Okay, then. fall, and then he blocks the pipe. Frozen for a little bit, so you kind of got to hurry with him. All right, let's bash a bunch of fishies. Ooh, sea urchin, yes! Five extra lives. Yeah, there's tons of ice flowers in this level. All you gotta do is just look. All right, hurry up and open, Clampy. That pipe will help blow you up in case you were trying to get that extra life, which I was. So it helped blow me up and get to the top faster. Mario time. Alright, time to fight the Goomba. Yeah, because he's going to move right where I'm going to go now. So I'm going to have to fight him. But that's okay. Goombas are easy. Ooh, look at this. <laughs> Ice is OP. Alright, Red Toad House. And then we'll do the last two levels before the castle. The mushroom level, the spinning ground level, and then the castle. Excuse me. This one's bad. I knew it.
This one's bad. Oh, I thought it would be a Bowser Jr., though. Dang it. The Bowser Jr. ones are over there. I got a mushroom. I can get plenty of those. Screw you. <laughs> mushroom level. Here we go. This one's fun. Mushroom levels are always fun. Whoa. You gotta slide under that one to make the vine go up instead of ground pounding it to make it go down. Yeah, let me start on this side so I can wait for that mushroom to go down. Okay. Just a few coins up there. Oh, perfect landing. Oh, what? Screw you too. Okay. No movement. In case you don't have propeller, you can just use that Koopa's head. I got three, two, one on the time. Oh yeah, Mario time. I was really hoping I was going to get 322 cuz I saw the time and I was like 323 three, and then changed to 322 two, and I was like touch the flag pole. No, you didn't get a toad house. Well, then again, 22 two would have given us a one up toad house. Yeah, if you get the last two numbers on the time the same when you touch the flag pole, it gives you a toad house. Two ones and two twos give you a green toad house. Nines give you a star toad house and everything in between gives you a red one. Just to clarify that. It's only, it hasn't even been 30 minutes yet. It's been 29 minutes. And I'm gonna keep propeller. See what I mean? I love keeping propeller. There's another propeller. I guess I'll get invincibility then. Oh, I got another propeller. Well. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Hold on. Not yet. Screw you, Goombas. Okay, now midway point. Oh, screw you, Goombas. You see, there's a reason why I didn't bump those power-up blocks. One sec. Holy cow. Okay. 
There, now I get a power up. Whoa, okay. Oh, wait, I want an extra life. Yay. I'm awesome. Now it's been 31 minutes. <laughs> Final level of the world, the castle. And this is my favorite castle in the whole game, by the way, is the World 1 castle. So this is going to be fun. Yeah. Here we go. The two button didn't let me jump. How dare you? Oh, well, I'll use the mushroom that I got from the toad house instead of from the Goomba. Pro tip, use mushrooms before a level instead of using a full power-up, unless you need a certain power-up. But try to use just mushrooms, because, of course, at the beginning of every level, there's going to be a power-up block. Just a pro tip. Yes. More propellers. Here we go. Here's the boss. Here comes Magi Koopa. Uh, 
that's a one! Woohoo! World one complete in 36 minutes. <laughs> That was easy. And there goes Bowser Jr. Help! Help me, Mario! Don't worry, Peach. We'll come save you. Right after we take a short break. So in the next episode, everyone... Oh, wait. You got all the stock ones in World 1. Hey. <laughs> and then here comes Roy. Roy Koopa. The dude with the shades. Aha! Save. Okay. So that's the end of part one, everyone. Tune in next time for part two, where we will do the entirety of World 2. So, hope you all enjoyed. Tune in for more. See you later.